today, everybody. My opponent for this game will be a Rational Gaze with 94 wins. And hello again and welcome to Xelnaga Caverns. I am today largely spawning as a red Terran and if you saw my last game I'm s still s sticking with these Terran pieces. I'm starting to feel mm, quite comfortable. Uh, it, it's not great play by me, Th that's not what I mean, but uh, it feels like I have a clue of what I'm actually doing when I'm playing and that is a good feeling. And on the other side of the map, in the top right position, we have a Rational Gaze spawning as the blue Terran, so this will be a Terran versus Terran game, just that, like the last one I think, yeah, I think that was it, oh well, never mind. Uh, it has been a quite busy week, haven't had uh, have time to play that much. Um, well, during the last week I had uh, visitors here and that was, uh, well, it was nice. And uh, during the weekend I actually had a lot of time to play, but uh, me and two of my friends actually uh, on Friday we all played single player Diablo and finished that bad boy up and uh, then on Saturday and Sunday we actually teamed up together and played Diablo 2 uh, and with the expansion as well and uh, it was really really nice uh, but well let's see what's going on here let me get this up as well uh, nothing very strange is coming up except I just started a barracks up here. Uh, it's a bit of a cheesy play, I have to say, but um, I'm okay with that. I'm trying to just mess around a little, try new stuff. And in the meantime, what's going on over here? One gas, one barracks, and uh, nothing else here. We'll see orbit command. The same down here as well. So the strange thing in this game is is of course this barracks that is a bit lost and you can see how our original gaze is scouting in here and what will he see? We'll see one barracks no gas and what will he suspect? see one marine camping out as well and he runs away and he there is no way for him to just move in once again if he moves in I will be able to kill him no problem at all and I am getting yet another barracks here as well, so I'm getting a third barracks, two of them hidden. But Rational Gaze is actually getting his second barracks here as well, so he might be able to defend. And he's getting a Reaper, and that is something that really, really slows you down quite a lot. Because they take forever to build, what is it, Fifth, yeah, 45 seconds. And he's trying to move out here, he's probably taking, yeah, he's taking the tower. But uh, I am starting to gather up some forces up here, getting the CV down again. And I'm just now getting my gas there, and if you check, I'm actually ahead in SVs by 2 right now. So I'm doing quite alright. Of course, I do not have a command center on the way, but uh, has he, he? He doesn't see anything. If you move, I, w I make, made sure that I would take this tower, and then I'm just moving up this path, and he can actually not see me. There we see he's, he managed to spot me. I think I got no, maybe not. He's just going for it. So I'm timing this this perfectly, and then I'm moving up here. I'm able to take one reaper out and go for the second one as well there. He has to move back with these two reapers. Because if he goes for a base trade, there's nothing he can do. These marines are too strong for him to be able to defend that properly. And uh, I'm getting surround surrounded here. He uses his SVs, he's using his reapers to try to clean this up. But if you look at the units lost there, I am. Uh, well, he's lost twice the mount. And if you look at. Oh, I see it. It's. I was actually able to kill 10 SCVs and if you see this 22 SCVs to 11 I'm doubling his SCV count taking my two barracks over there flying home 
My macro slipped heavily, I'm getting an expansion, and in the meantime, I'm deciding to, well, I'm continue this, I'm getting a lot of barracks. Continuing to build SCVs, and making sure that I'm not supply capped, since I just lost a couple of my bunch of marine, actually. And I'm actually poking up here once again, we did just well, two, two guys standing in the front here, so well, why not. And I'm actually able to slow him down quite heavily and I've got a read on what's going on in his base. But he is up to five reapers right now, but I'm aware of them, so I have a banker here. So if he tries to jump up here, I will be okay. And here we go, I'm going in to land with my two barracks, but he is in the way. And I'm just messing everything up here. This is a bit messy actually. Uh, I'm defended on uh, this side, but not on the other one. And I'm heavily miscontrolling my buildings right here. Uh, so I'm lifting up just another one, because that's a good idea, I think. But he actually finally pins himself in here, and I am able to snipe this and look at this. Um, I actually lost a few workers, but still 12 to 5. I'm so far ahead if you could units tab. Still all oh, nine SCVs ahead. And I have a second command center. Well he does not. So we'll be able to produce two at a time. We'll be able to get an expansion up. And uh, I will not be able to spend my money apparently, because I'm awful. I'm salvaging this one. Seems like I do not really need it. Getting a factory with the uh, tech lab, getting a starport. And I'm getting a lot of minerals right now, and I'm trying to spend it, and uh, guessing I'm spending it on queuing up. Well, not that bad, just one. And there we go. So I'm doing alright. Little queuing, but uh, it's not okay really. But it, it is what happens when you're awful. Getting myself a new bunker just to be safe on the expansion since I know he's uh, roaming around with his reapers. And I'm producing a um, lot of mariners right now. Well, I'm broke. So I have too much uh, unit construction buildings and um, too little minerals. But I'm trying to do my best to spend it. And uh, well, even though I'm not spending it perfectly, I'm still able to out macro him by far. If you look at you in the stop here, still te well, 10 SVs ahead. And I can mule uh, the double amount. Here we go, we actually moving in with Reapers once again, moving in to the back here. And he's able to see quite a few of my units here, I'm just pulling up here. And uh, this bunker is able to clean this up. Well, not to really clean this up, but to, to chase them away. And he's just running away. I'm moving down some marines to make sure I'm okay here. Getting a new bunker. It will block the gas, but I'm not really taking it right now, so it's okay. And I will pr continue my production of SCVs. So I'm st uh, still ahead, uh, even though I lost. Well, I should. Where are my SV production? Come on! You can do it now. Okay. Well, never mind. I'm starting to get some tanks. Moving up here, we have I do have the siege tech, and he's trying to bunker himself in up here. And he's moving in once again here, but my tank is positioned well here, and boom, and a second shot maybe. There we go. Get marines into the bunker, and it goes down, and I am. Did he cancel the... Oh, it's over there. I am able to siege up on the low ground here. And with the, this scan, I was able to see what's going on. And I do keep vision with these marines. And if he tries to move, move in here, I will be able to... Snipe him. I should have gotten one second shot away. But he salvaged it. And here we go, he's moving in here. Once again, but this tank will be able to do a lot of damage, and uh, 
together with the second tank I will be just fine I will lose my troops but not before dealing heavy amounts of damage and what will I do then? Well I will take my Macroid Force and start to move up with all these. I'm getting some Marines into this Medivac as well to be able to split him up. He cannot defend on two fronts. I do know that he's battered down quite heavily. I know that he cannot have that many units left since I just killed him off. So moving up through the back should probably go go the other way but I uh, prefer this way uh, when I'm in control because if I move up uh, with this huge force and he sees me he still has to make the decision will I split up and die in the front or will I try to hold the front and die in the back and uh, so this does not bother me at all because he kind of have to fight in the front as well that one heavy on here just messing around and I am moving in from the back here as well Trying to do the dropperoni. There we go. These marines have great position if he's trying to pull SCVs to attack me. And as you can see, it is dealing stupid amount of damage. 40 SCVs down. There is the good game. And I am able to close this game up. I just have to check something. Well, as you can see, I'm not playing fast at all. It's Terran. I'm not there yet. I'm trying to, you know find out ways to win. And this is one way to um, do a proxy Jabal Barracks there with a third in the main. Then into mass barracks with just some medivacs and some tanks. Apparently it works, at least against rational gaze. So that is everything for me right now. Thank you everybody and goodbye.